Well guys, tonight ends the hardest part of the training cycle. I have week 12 under the belt. Week 13, week 14 are next. Those are back down weeks where now I let the fatigue seriously diminish. I'll not be lifting uh, anything heavy anymore after a heavy deadlift on Sunday. And that's still up in the air, but everything else, the weight is coming way down. The assistance work is coming way down. That way I can uh, focus on getting lots of rest, dialing in my diet to an absolute T until I get to the perfect weight within my weight class so I don't lose any strength, but so that my leverages, so that my body moves uh, and performs doing this training protocol justice. So thank you again, Coach John. A wonderful, awesome, super spectacular training cycle comes to an end with 345 for 5x5 five five on the safety squat bar. And I thought this was going to be heavy and feel very, very heavy, but uh, it feels, it felt, I'd say out of it on a scale of 1 to 10, it felt like a 7. So, um, and this is, and I'm probably seven or eight pounds lighter than I was yesterday. So that's a good sign. I'm dialing that diet in right now. It's time to bring it down, maybe about 11, 12 pounds. That'll get me right into my weight class and shouldn't affect my strength at all. Shouldn't affect my power production. It should only help things and um, I keep my snake juice up now. Keep those muscles loaded with salt and uh, potassium. And get my rest, get a good uh, meal plan going, so no carbs until uh, training days. And on training days, I dial those carbs in to an absolute T, so that uh, on the morning of the meet, I have a few pounds to play with, so I can weigh in, and I'm going to bring my meal to the meet, so I don't have to drive anywhere, I can just sit right there. Eat my food, be the first one to weigh in, chill out, and uh, get all the I's dotted, T's crossed, all the all the meat formalities, get those out of the way. Eat, sit back, relax, and let them carbs soak up into my up into my musculature, and uh, put on my maniac uh, put on my maniac attitude and light it up because. This training cycle, I think, was the hardest training cycle I've ever done by Coach John. And uh, quite frankly, 12 weeks ago, I looked at it and said, holy shit, this thing's going to kill me. But it didn't. It only made me stronger. I completed, uh, I completed, I completed 12 weeks so far. I completed the highest, I completed, I completed to this point the highest peak meaning the highest weight I'm going to pull, except maybe on Sunday I might have a deadlift to pull or a triple that's 500 pounds. Not quite sure if we're going to go for that or not. I would rather not go for it. I think it would just be better for me to uh, uh, to keep 500 off the bar, 500 plus off the bar until the day of the meet where uh, everything's totally well rested and I'm chopping at the bit because I don't know what kind of, uh, how many people are going to be at the meet could be a small group of people, and that could be, uh, if it's a small group of people in my in my group of lifters, then uh, letting the fatigue wear off will only do me good, in my opinion, because I am in condition, I am fit to power lift, I am fit, 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 ready to, uh, to, to go and light it up, I just need to let all the fatigue wear off, but then again, um, you know, two days from now, I'll be well rested. I'll be ready to uh, to pull something heavy, and then, you know, for week thirteen, week fourteen, week fifteen, that's twenty one days. So I think I've answered my own question. I think I am going to go for that triple, uh, that five hundred for three, and uh, then after that, just let everything mellow out. Keep blood flow going. Keep a nice uh, keep a nice training program going. There's still much more to do uh, in the gym. But the intensity, meaning how much is on the barbell, is definitely coming down now. 
and uh, and that's just a beautiful thing. If you've ever power lifted or if you get into power lifting, you're gonna find out that all the hard work, all the grunting, all the straining, all the making it to the to the uh, to the gym, and not ever, ever, ever saying, "Oh, I'm not gonna go because I don't feel like it." Uh, that's baby, that's baby ass shit. We don't play that in the powerlifting world. You get your ass to the gym, you train up, my friend. That's what you do. You prioritize. So, finishing off here with some demos. I took a set of 15, and then I took a set of 10 to get my 25 because, quite frankly, it was getting late. The new job keeps me late, and I need to get some sleep. So I have to shave off some time where I can. Thank you for the program, coach. See you on the next one.